Hey, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to another video. And today we've got some very, 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 very interesting news. And it involves Last of Us 2, and it also involves the leaker who released the leaks of The Last of Us Part 2. And apparently it looks like that the leaker has been caught, and it's not a disgruntled Naughty Dog employee. So, uh, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and let's get rock rolling into this article. So... The Last of Us 2 leaker has been caught, and it's not a disgruntled Naughty Dog employee. Sony can't say who it was due to impending investigations. Sony has identified the people responsible for the massive Last of Us 2 leaks, and it's not the rumored disgruntled Naughty Dog employee. Hmm. According to a report from Polygon, SIE... Sony Interactive Entertainment, has identified the primary individuals responsible for the unauthorized release of The Last of Us 2's assets, a Sony rep told Polygon. They are not affiliated with Naughty Dog or Sony Interactive Entertainment. We are unable to comment further because the information is subject to an ongoing investigation. Wow, so the, the investigation is still going on like right now. It's nuts. All right. As Games Radar previously reported, a ton of information about The Last of Us 2 leaked in late April, including cutscenes, a complete list of levels, and spoilers for the entire plot. Since the leaked footage appeared to be from an internal build, and Naughty Dog has previously been called out for some serious crunch issues, rumors swirled that a disgruntled former employee was behind the leaks. Okay. Now it's clear that this isn't the case, and it seems like more than one person was involved based on Sony's statement, which refers to the guilty party as individuals. It's not clear whether we'll ever find out who these people are, or how they seem to have gotten their hands on what looks like an internal Naughty Dog bill. There's also no word yet on what sort of legal ramifications these individuals will face. But considering there's now an army of jerks spamming Twitch chats and live streams with the last of us two spoilers, I sincerely hope justice is served piping hot. Oh, oh man, this is a lot. All right, in the okay, in the past, video games leagues have been subject to the fullest extent of the law, like Epic suing several testers who leaked Fortnite Chapter Two and Nintendo sending. Subpoen, subpenny, wait. Subpoena, wait. Poenis, I guess. Subpoenis, I guess I'll just say that. Not sure how you really pronounce that word, but to whoever leaked images from Pokemon Sword and Shield before its release. For more, check out everything revealed in Last of Us 2's update break info drop or watch below for hands on gameplay preview of the sequel. Wow, that's it. Well, uh, wow, wow, that was a turn. Like I did not expect that at all. Uh, wow. And not only that, but there was a video that I watched on Tyrell Madness's gaming channel because he does gaming news on his gaming channel. Uh. What he did is that he read an article and it was about why the leaked footage had made it to the internet. Like, what really went down to Naughty Dog. And it's a, this is a rumor. And the rumor is that Naughty Dog did not give them their bonuses like they should have deserved. But what happened... Because, like, people were asking them for their bonuses early. But they wouldn't give it to them. But apparently, when Neil Druckmann and some other higher class uh, professionals at Naughty Dog... They asked for their bonuses early, and they actually got them early, and no one else did, which was kind of unfair. And I was like, okay, mate, this does... When I saw that video, I was like, okay, this makes sense why the employee, or it turns out it's not the employee, it's someone, like, other people, apparently. Uh, 
but in that video, I was like, okay, I can see why they would do that because they should. They didn't get their bonus list like they should have. And it was a lot, too. Like, people, like, with those bonuses, you know what they were going to do all that? They were going to plan weddings. They were going to buy houses, send their kids to college. It was nuts. And it's like, whoa, like, Naughty Dog just really turned all of them down like that? Like, I'm not going to lie. That's kind of wrong to do that, though. But, uh, with this article I just read, this is quite a turn. Like, ew, this is a... Wow, I, I really did not expect this to happen at all. Like, I really didn't. Yeah, but, uh, this is... Wow, this is a lot. This is really a lot, though. And, like, apparently, by the looks of it, the article has said that the investigations are still ongoing, which means they, they're still going on right now. Uh, maybe later on today, they'll maybe like, they, they said they did identify them, but later on today, like once the investigation's over or I don't know how long, no one knows how long this investigation is going to take. Like no one does. Like maybe, I mean, we don't know if this investigation is going to be over with by the end of the day today, or if it's going to like continue on throughout like the rest of the weekend and all that. Like I, no one knows right now. This is like. Just new information we have right now. Maybe later on today, maybe they might release some new information they have about the investigations and the leakers and all that. But I'm just very shocked. So apparently they're saying that it's not it it's not a former Naughty Dog employee. Well, it's just wow. It, I don't know what. Yeah, like, this is just nuts, though. Uh, wow. As you guys can see, I am in shock after reading this article. Because when I saw that Tyrell Madness video, when he was, uh, when he was reading the article of why the so-called employee, uh, did what he did by releasing those leaks... I was like, okay, this adds up. I kind of get why he would release the leaks. But now everything is kind of off now. Like, the story just has holes in it now because the fact of how now people are saying that it wasn't a disgruntled Naughty Dog employee. It was some other individuals. They didn't give us, they didn't give us our, you know, they didn't give the identities in the article. But maybe later on today, they might reveal their identities later on today. Or maybe not. They might just want to keep that private, but they probably will release information on how the investigation went. And, like, the thing is, is that it's... Okay, here's what kind of gets me, is that... Okay, if these weren't... Okay, if these individuals weren't from Naughty Dog, I don't know if it's possible that the, that the leaks could have been fake. Like, maybe they just tried their hardest, and I'm just spitballing here, but maybe, like, they just tried their hardest, like, to make the gameplay and the leaks look actually legit. Or, yeah, maybe all that stuff could have been real. Like I said, I don't know what were in those leaks because I don't like reading leaks for anything, and I'm not spoiling the game for myself. I don't want to do that because I hate having stuff spoiled for myself, and that's what I'm doing. That's what I'm doing right now is that I'm avoiding these Last of Us Part 2 leaks because I do not want to read the Last of Us Part 2 leaks since I don't want the game spoiled for myself. But yeah, but they said it's like from a Naughty Dog, you know, eternal build. So it could be real or it could be fake. We don't know. Like I said, that's just like everything for every leak, like for practically everything. It's like, okay, maybe this could be real. Maybe it's not because it, sometimes, yeah. It may look legit, but it turns out sometimes it could turn out to be fake, or sometimes it could turn out to be real. Like, yeah, it's it's a 50-50 when it comes to leaks for everything. Like, that's the way I would put it. But, yeah, this is just very odd. Like, it's just very odd. Like, I legit thought that it was a an employee who did that, because after seeing that Tyrone Madness video where he read the article, I was like, 
Okay, maybe that. Okay, it that does add up why he would do that, yeah. or why they would do that. But they're not from Naughty Dog, though. So, yeah, uh, I hope you guys did enjoy this video of me reading the new article about uh, the leakers getting caught. Uh, maybe later on today they'll release some more new information, and if they do, I'll make sure to read that article to you guys in another video later on today if they release new information today but uh yeah don't forget to like comment subscribe and uh put down in the comment section below what did you think about this are you shocked as i am about this like did you really expect them to say all this saying that it wasn't an employee it was other individuals who did it but anyways guys just leave it down in the comment section below and let me know and uh yeah i'll see you guys in the next video all right see you guys and peace out